Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer WooCommerce products from one website to another website, including images. And we will be using one of our previous website. This is the website that we created in our last video, which have these demo products. And we will be transferring actual products to this website. And for that, I have this website. This is just a temporary domain. And if I go to products, and here I have these products. And we have 462 products in total. We will see how we can export these products from this domain from this website to this website. So let's see how we can do this. So the first thing is you can log into a WordPress dashboard to the first website and here you will have to export these products. So to export the products you can click on export and here you can scroll down and here you can choose the columns that you want to export. You can choose the products that you want to export. You can choose the categories only and so on. But if you want to export all the products, all the columns and all the categories, you can leave these as default. And then make sure to check this box to export the metadata also and then generate CSV. Now this will generate a CSV file and then we will have to import that file to that website. So I already have this CSV file but let's wait for this or let me show you. And this is the CSV file for that products and you can see the size is just 1.7 MB. So we just need to upload this to our WordPress dashboard to the new website. So for that, let's go to our new dashboard. So this is the dashboard for this website and here I'll go to products. And as you can see, we have 61 products here. So we will need to remove these because these are just demo products. Let's view all and we'll select all, bulk action, go to trash. And now we don't have any products. Let's do the same for categories. So to remove all categories and here we have 69 categories. So let's select all. We'll choose delete, apply. Again we'll select all, delete, apply and all categories deleted. Now we can go back to products and this time we will choose import. And here we will choose that CSV file. So just click on choose file. So I'll select that file, we'll click open. And you can check this if you have existing products, but I don't have any products. So let's click on continue. And then this will take you to column mapping page where you can map the columns based on ID, type and so on. So these are the column name and these are the map fields. So you can leave these all as default because this is not necessary and everything will be good. So scroll down all the way to the bottom and click run the importer. And this will start importing the products. So as you can see importing, your products are now being imported. So now this will start importing the product and this will go all the way to the end. So this will be dependent on your hosting speed and internet speed. Let's wait for this and I'll show you the result. And done. Import complete. Now you can just view your products. And you can see we got all 462 products here along with the images with title, prices, SQ, categories and so on. And now if I visit categories, you can see we got all 56 items here with all the categories and subcategories. And now let's check this on live website. So I'll go to pages and we'll go to shop page. Let's open this in a new tab. And you can see we got all the products here. Let's open any of these. So we have the main image, we have the title, the price, the variations, the description and so on. So this was how you can export and import WooCommerce products from one website to another website along with images, categories, titles and prices. And if you want to learn more about Wolfis Elementor and WooCommerce, you can follow my channel. I have lots of videos about Wolfis. And still, if you have any questions, you can ask in the comment section. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next.